2023 Ford F150 Tremor First Test, Bargaft, ist that the Tremors Music? America is smack in the middle of a golden age of mudslinging, but you don't need to doomscroll Twitter or walk the halls of Washington DC, for proof. Instead, stroll through any parking lot, where factory off-road pickup trucks are stacked like firewood. They come in all strengths and sizes and wear names that sound like discount pro wrestlers, but the core, as it is for pickups in general, is half tonner such as the Ford F150 Tremor. Once a street truck appearance package, of all things, the Tremor name is now applied to dirt-centric F150 Sekunden that cover the broad middle ground between the lightly fatlet FX4 and the absolutely stonking, hardcore Raptor. It's a mission the Tremor attacks with unoperated suspension, increased ground clearance, 33-inch tires, improved approach, breakover, and departure angles, a transfer case similar to the Raptors, and a standard locking rear differential. The Tremor package is only available on a four-door supercrew with a 5.5-foot bed, with either a 5.0-liter naturally aspirated V8 or a 3.5-liter twin-turbo V6 mated to a 10-speed automatic. This is fine with us. The supercrew body means lots of rear-seared room for stretching out or stashing stuff on a flat floor with a buck bench folded up. The bed could be longer, sure, but then the truck would be less wieldy on trails or around town. With 400 horsepower and RB500 Pfund FT of torque, the boosted V6 is, as we found in many other F150 Sekunden, smooth and strong, and the transmission does its thing pretty much unnoticed. Together, they shot our tremor to 60 miles pro stunde in an eye-opening 5.5 seconds, but the truck feels even quicker than that. Thus even a little sportiness to its street moves, some of the old, lower tremors DNR, perhaps Fragezeichen with the upgraded suspension delivering improved body control and a slightly firmer ride versus other F150 Sekunden. The ride is still reasonably supple, but you will notice more vibrations and jiggles in the cabin. The steering is light and accurate, albeit numb, and the tremor tracks true on the freeway even on the squishy tread blocks of its 33-inch General Grabber ATX tires. The brake pedal doesn't have much feel, but it is linear and predictable, and the truck stops from 60 miles pro stunde in 129 feet, about par for the segment. Where the tremor really shines, of course, is away from pavement. We spent a day wheeling at an off-road park, and there wasn't a time it felt at all particularly challenged. This included taking on man-made concrete whoops meant to unload opposite corners, as well as a steep hill climb that was frozen and snow-covered to start and that turned into a sloppy, gooey slurry later in the day. We can't remember even bothering to activate the tremor's low range except to see how it affected the truck's behavior. Spoiler, it just made it more unstoppable.